Sacramento City officials will be taking on their next massive project, what to do with the convention center in downtown Sacramento. Officials say that it will boost tourism and it will get the city notice. Tonight, the city council will be looking at design and planning, but before they hire the architects, many are still wondering who will pay for it. CBS 13's Lamore Abrams is live outside city council with the getting answer story. Lamore. Tony, Sam, the meeting is just about to get underway here at City Hall, and city officials will be making the case that local taxpayers have nothing to worry about. This massive project will be paid for potentially with outside tourist dollars, so critics say it's a money waster, and we have no money to pay for it. The Sacramento Convention Center draws hundreds of events and big bucks every year. It's about what happens around it with the hotels and the restaurants. But the man in charge of bringing those events to Sacktown says the city could be raking in a lot more money with a more modern convention center. When we compete against other cities and they're looking at our 20 year old product versus a two year old product in San Jose, uh, it, it's hard for us to compete on that level. Visit Sacramento's Mike Testa says it's a multi million dollar decision finally going before city council. What will a new and improved convention center look like? This newly released rendition gives us a clue. Think huge exhibit halls that can host more than one event at a time, an outdoor public plaza and amphitheater, and a thoroughfare connecting the center to the river. An estimated 90 to $125 million plan for construction costs only. So who will pay for it? Tourists. It's out of towners that, that pay. For Desmond Parrington is the project manager. He says the project will primarily be paid for with hotel tax revenue, but he says visitors would also benefit with a top notch facility. Currently, our existing convention center, about half of it, particularly the 1970 side, it has um, ceilings that are too low, it doesn't have good access to the loading docks. Uh, there's just um, a number of, of uh, some, some challenges with it. It's still unclear what the massive project would cost as a whole, but a Sacramento watchdog group says it has a figure in mind and it's not affordable. This crazy project could cost the city taxpayers close to a half of a billion dollars. Just this piece on the convention center. Now, if the city has its way, the project would break ground next year and would take a couple years to complete, but that's just phase one. Phase two would look at adding a big ballroom and a much anticipated hotel room that would serve the convention center. The next massive project the city is looking at going before the city council right now. Guys, All back right. to you. Lamore, thank you very much. Live for us tonight in downtown Sacramento.